I'm Frank Jobins, telling you what's happening around the world. Nine African automakers that you've probably never heard of. African car makers aren't very popular, and we're quite sure you wouldn't have heard of any of these companies. We've all heard a lot about American, European, and Asian vehicles, but what about African manufacturers and models? Believe it or not, Africa has quite a few car manufacturers, and many of them are doing quite well for themselves. From Algeria to Zimbabwe, African automotive companies provide vehicles for cities and villages all over this beautiful continent. Let's take a look at some of the best. 9. SNVI SNV is a vehicle manufacturing company that is based in Algeria. If you ride a bus around there, it's probably built by SNVI. It has produced trucks and buses for the country, and beyond, since 1967. SNVI is actually a subsidiary of SONACOME, also called the National Mechanical Construction Company. Sonicum was founded by the Algerian government in 1967 and inherited French-era's Berlier factories and equipment after Berlier stopped operations in 1973. SNVI is still up and going strong as of today and makes many high-quality buses and work trucks. Eight. Kira Motors Corporation. This innovative company, based in Uganda, is ahead of the other companies we have talked about so far. It is in the EV market and prides itself on creating Africa's first electric car. Similar to SNVI, Kira builds large city buses, as well as smaller vehicles. It also helps the country out by creating jobs for locals and boosting the country's economy. Its electric buses are quite amazing. The Kayula EVS is a fully electric low-floor city bus that has a range of 186 miles on a full charge. That's pretty impressive considering its massive size. 7. Laraki. Laraki Automobiles SA is a Moroccan-based manufacturing company that develops and builds high-performance sports cars. It is based in Casablanca, Morocco. Laraki was established in 1999 by Abdeslam Laraki. He was a Moroccan designer and entrepreneur who gained his wealth by importing cars into Morocco beginning in 1973. His son, Abdeslam Laraki, later took over the company. He became a designer like his father and started out creating luxurious yachts. He also gave the company its name we know today, Laraki. Following the steps of his father, he went to Switzerland to major in automobile design. Soon after he launched his first model, the Laraki Fulgura, in 2002. 6. Mobius Motors. Mobius Motors is a vehicle company founded in 2010 in the African country of Kenya. It was incorporated in the United Kingdom in 2010 and registered in Kenya in 2011. In 2018, the company began building its first in-country manufacturing plant. Mobius specializes in manufacturing tough SUVs that can handle bumpy roads and off-road areas with ease. This is because Kenya is home to many rough roads and rugged terrain that are part of the regional countryside. 5. Nord Automobile. Nord Automobiles is a Nigerian automotive manufacturer with headquarters in Lagos, Nigeria. Our establishment was born out of the need for a remarkable Made in Nigeria automobile brand. Its operations focus on delivering quality expertise in the value chain, which includes the design, sourcing, development, assembling, distribution, marketing, provision of sales and after-sales service of its unique Nigerian-branded automobiles. Its fleet of Nigerian-branded vehicles include the Nord Tank, Nord Max, Nord Tusk, Nord Flit, Nord A3 Sedan, Nord A5 SUV, Nord A7 SUV, Nord Yarn, Nord Tripper, Nord Lasky, etc. 4. Birkin Cars. Here we have an interesting little company that only makes one car. Based in South Africa, the Birkin Car Company's specialty, and only currently produced vehicle, is the S3 Roadster. It's actually a kit car copy of the Lotus Super 7. The founder and owner of the company is a man named John Watson. He is a direct descendant of the legendary Tim Birkin. 
Tim was a pioneering British racing driver, one of the Bentley boys of the 1920s. That's some pretty cool history for this humble little company. Three, Wally's car. Founded by a man named Zied Giga, Wally's car is a Tunisian car manufacturer that was formed in 2006. It is based in Ben Arouse. While it is based in Africa, the company actually sells vehicles all over the world, including Panama, France, Spain, Qatar, and Morocco. Wally's car works closely with the French automobile company, Peugeot, which provides the engines in its vehicles. It is known for two vehicles, the Isis and the Iris. Both are sturdy little Jeep-like vehicles that are built to last and can handle rough terrain if needed. 2. Kantanka Automobile Kantanka Automobile is a Ghana-based automotive company that builds luxury cars. It was established in 1994 by entrepreneur and preacher, Kwadwo Safo Kantanka. The first Kantanka vehicle was manufactured in 1994 as prototype sedan by the Kantanka Group founder, Apostle Dr. Ng. Kwadwo Safo, the company has taken off since then exploring various means to increase driving and affordability comforts of the average Ghanaian. Mass production began in 2016 with the company setting up its first showroom in 2018. It currently enjoys mass support and usage across West Africa with patronage cutting across social classes. Ghana's finance minister in 2021, Ken Ofori Atta, is a proud user of a Kantanka Amoanima saloon car. 1. Innocent Vehicle Manufacturing Innocent Vehicle Manufacturing, IVM, is a Nigerian automobile manufacturer that is headquartered in Nui, Enambra, Nigeria. It was founded by a local chief by the name of Innocent Chukwama Nawala. IVM has earned the nickname of the Pride of African Road. The company claims that 70% of its car parts are produced locally, while the rest are sourced from Japan, China, and Germany. It produces a wide range of vehicles, from its three-wheeled Keke, which is the main source of transportation in Nigeria, to its wide assortment of other vehicles ranging from minivans to pickup trucks. This is the end of our program today. See you on Intervlog same time tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates. Thank you for watching Intervlog. I'm Frank, thank you for watching.